my channel today's video is going to be super duper exciting because i am so excited about today's video this is my first haul video and i'm sure today's video is going to be full of confessions so to start with shall i start with what the video is all about before confessing so this video is going to be a huge sarojini nagar haul i went to sarojini last week with my cousin thank you so much nishu for taking all the time with me and taking me to sarojini nagar and the confession that i want to make is that despite being in gurgaon which is like right just next to delhi and i'm only 5 minutes away from delhi so despite being here for almost 9 more than 9 years in fact this was the first time I went to Sarojini Nagar. I know guys, I know it might be a shocker for a lot of you all out there, but what to do? I never got a chance. I have been thinking uh, about going to Sarojini since a long long time, but then this had to happen now, so it finally happened and I was so happy that I finally got to go to Sarojini. I really really enjoyed my experience. It was so much fun shopping at Sarojini Nagar. So today's haul is going to be a huge and a very very interesting haul. I promise that to you guys and stay tuned. You can just grab a cup of coffee for yourself because this is going to be as I said a huge haul and I am just going to start by showing you this huge bag full of stuff which I got from Sarojini. So let's get started with our haul. So the first thing that I got from Sarojini is itself this big red bag which i had to buy from there looking at the market knowing myself that i'm going to really really dig into the market and get a lot of stuff so the first thing that i did was i bought this bag and guys it costed me only 100 rupees believe you me for all those who have not been to sarojini yet it is a crazy place it is insane you know uh, in fact there is a second confession that i want to make and that is I always used to think that you know buying from flea markets or you know stuff which is available on streets probably is of an inferior quality it's not that great so I personally it's just my personal thing I personally never took interest in you know going to these markets and doing my shopping but after going to Sarojini and after looking at the stuff that's available there no matter you have to dig deep into the market you need to have a knack to you know mop up the green stuff from the market but my perception has changed believe me my perception has absolutely changed i thoroughly enjoyed shopping from there and you get all kind of stuff you will find inferior stuff but you as i said you need to know how to get the right kind of thing for yourself and you need to have an eye for that kind of stuff which i finally got and i'm quite happy with whatever i got so let me start with my haul so the first thing that i showed you was of course the bag that i got First thing I'm going to start with are the accessories. So I will be showing you what I got. So the first piece that I got is this really um jazzy, snazzy, cool looking multi-layered chain neck piece. This is very very I find it very very stylish. I really liked it. It was available in gold. I got the gold one. It was also available in silver and I think uh oxidized silver. So I got this gold and I'm wearing this for you guys right now. My hair is all over the place in this weather. It's really really bad. So this is the neck piece. I hope you guys can see. I'm just going to raise myself so that you guys can see it is it is chunky yet at the same time it doesn't look uh too loud or bold. It's delicate chunky, I would call it. And I really love it. It's so so pretty and it doesn't look cheap at all. It looks nice. It looks finished. So I got this one as my first piece of accessories. And guys, you will not believe the price i got this piece for only 50 rupees i mean this is insane unbelievable the next piece that i got is this really pretty very very offbeat looking necklace the best thing which i liked about this necklace is the 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 thread uh you know the threads that they have used which gives it a very tribal look I loved the color of this necklace. It's a pale dull pink, um very summery, absolutely subtle 
and this is what it looks like i love these fringes you know they look so cute it gives it such a tribal ethnic sort of a look and i got it because i loved it so the third piece is also a necklace which is this oh my god just look at this you guys look at the beauty of this necklace nobody will say i got it from sarojini uh, and by the way the necklace that i just showed you this one i got it for 100 rupees and this one also for just 100 bucks <clears throat> sorry and this is also oh so gorgeous i absolutely loved it i'll just put it on like this and show it you guys as you can see this is looking so beautiful on this black top that i'm wearing any dark plain base this necklace is gonna rock okay so the next piece of accessories are these shades that i got very unlikely of me to pick up shades uh, because uh, the only thing is that I like to wear something which gives me protection against the ultraviolet rays, something which is polarized. Though these aren't polarized, but I really, really like them because first thing first, the gold and the brown combination gives it such a nice, uh, classy look. It does not look cheap or tacky at all. And the second thing is the this round frames that it has. So round frames, round shades are the in thing for 2016 so i actually was looking for something like this and this is how it looks on me okay so you guys can see how it looks upon me i really liked it i really enjoy wearing it and i loved it i love everything about these shades it's round it has a beautiful brown lens with these golden frames and this is just absolutely fabulous uh, i think i got these for 200 rupees the guy was quoting it to be 350 rupees and he gave it to me for just 200 rupees the next and the last piece in accessories which i got is this oh so cute little bag look at this i haven't taken out the, the, the packaging yet but this is how it looks like i can carry it just as you know a handbag or i can also use the sling that's given with it or i can detach the sling uh, whichever way i would use i can use it i loved it for its multi colors for its vibrancy it does not look loud though it's full of colors i love the blue base that they have given to it it is so summery it's going to go with so many different outfits and i absolutely loved it it is so so adorable this one i remember the the shopkeeper he was quoting 750 rupees and after a lot of requests actually he gave it to me for um, 600 rupees i believe so not a bad deal i mean i really liked it this was the only bag that i really really liked it and i thought i should not let it go let me just pick it up okay so this was for the accessories that i got now let's move on to the clothes this time i actually got a lot of uh, you know kaftans and kimonos so the first thing that i'm going to show you guys is this very very gorgeous it's like a cape it's not really a kaftan or a kimono it's a cape and i loved it for its beautiful color combination it's a leheria print and it has this really pretty um what do you call this i don't know you call it sequence sequin border all throughout and it's actually a full length cape that is the beauty of this piece that it will look so sexy uh so gorgeous so stunning with uh, you know tight fitted jeans or jeggings or jeggings and a tight fitted top and you can just throw it on it is so beautiful i loved it so this was the first piece the second piece that i got is again a sort of a loose top or a kimono if you can call it or a kaftan uh, this one i loved it for its multi colors i loved the detailing that they have given around the neck it also has a string that you can fasten around your waist to give it a more a fitted look and I'll just put it on on me. This is what it is. I really liked it for its multi colors. It's summertime and I love to wear a sheer fabrics with a lot of vibrant colors in it. And I'm sorry guys, I have no pictures to show you because I haven't uh, got the chance to style them up uh, 
now I was busy with some work and I was also not keeping very well but uh, don't worry you can follow me on Instagram my Instagram ID is sapna248 I will link it down below in the description box you can follow me on Instagram and I will be styling them, styling them up very soon and you can see how they look about me okay so the next piece is yet again a kimono and once again I loved it for its colors I loved it for the detailing that they have given around the neck they have used stones they have used um, uh, what do you call these the sequins a lot of such other stuff I, I'm not very good at keeping names and I loved it for its colors it's very summery it also has a string around the waist and I actually liked it a lot and you can see how it looks upon me so actually I got all these pieces from one shop and I think this was the only shop that had uh, so many so much a variety of uh, you know these beautiful kaftans and the last piece of my kaftan not the last piece of my haul is this yet again super gorgeous combination of peach and white and brown i love the color combination and i, I think i just picked it because of the colors that is, it has i didn't realize i got a very big size it's very big for me but then that's okay the kaftans are supposed to be loose if it's too loose i probably will just get it fitted or i'll just throw a belt upon it and you know style it up but this is what it is i really like the color these these are so summery and so beautiful and I love to wear something which is loose, which is comfortable but yet at the same time looks stylish. Uh, that's how my style is most of the times. Now these were my kaftans slash kimono slash cape and uh, just to uh, wear something underneath I got these two spaghettis, one in peach color and one in blue color. I think these are going to go well with these kimonos. And by the way, I got these kimonos, I think I got four of them and I paid, um, I think I paid 1000 rupees for all four of them. So that was quite a great deal, I think 250 rupees each, quite a great deal, quite a great deal. And I got these two spaghettis for 60 rupees each. Alright guys, so the next piece that I got is this super duper cute little dress. So I love the print, a very classic sporty looking stripe print it's it's a sleeveless dress it's uh, it's it falls below my knees and i love the fitting it's 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 neither too tight it's not too loose and still i have a belt attached to it which i can just fasten and make it look a little more fitted so this is what i got and i think this dress was also for 200 rupees then from the same shop i got another dress and you must look at it this is so pretty, so summery, it is full of colors, yet at the same time it looks subtle, it does not look loud. I loved it for its geometric print. It's also the same size as the previous one. It's sleeveless, it falls below my knees, it has a belt to just make it look a little more fitted and these are just so appropriate for summers. I just love it. I, I think I will just... Uh, team them up with my gladiators or maybe with my sneakers at a time um, even crocs I wear crocs very often they're so comfortable so I think they're gonna look really cool with these cute frog dresses so now we come to the next piece now this is a top and this is something which I have been looking for a very very long time uh, look at the beauty look at this cute little top it's an off-shoulder top with ruffles falling below the shoulders and it's also cropped and it has a string which I can again you know just tighten it up to make it look a little more fitted so I actually was looking for something like this to team it up with my high waist trousers or my high waist pants even my high waist skirts something like that and this is exactly what I got and I love to wear off shoulders in summers they look so feminine they look so chic and I have good shoulders I mean I can at least say that I have my waist I don't know when it's gonna get back to shape but I have good shoulders at least and I love to wear off shoulders to flaunt my shoulders to get that femininity you know exude so this is what I got after a lot of negotiation the guy gave it to me for just 125 rupees all right guys so the next thing which I got 
are these two tube skirts. I have been hunting for these like crazy and I never knew that I'm gonna find it in Sarojini, which I actually did. So this is a red and white striped tube skirt. It just falls all the way down till the floor and it has this elasticated band for the waist and it's just a very pretty, very summery, sporty looking red and white stripes and this guy you know he he was the only guy who had so much of variety of these skirts it got so tough for me and my cousin to actually you know decide which one to pick up and which one to leave he had these in plain colors he had this in combination of gray and white and black and white and green and white and what not blue and white and what not so after a lot of you know thought and contemplation and dilemma we finally decided that we are going to pick these two and the second one is just a different color combination it's the same tube skirt which falls all the way down till the floor it also has a slit somewhere yeah it has a slit on the side on one of the sides which makes it look flattering at the same time comfortable to walk around and also has an elasticated band if you guys have some great suggestions then please don't hesitate leave your comments below and let me know what's the best way to style them up uh, for somebody like me who has to you know think about camouflaging the waist all right so after the skirts what i got was this cute little top it's just a black and white sleeveless short top it's not exactly a crop top but it's a short top this is how it's gonna look on me i just like it because it's super soft it's very comfortable it's loose and it looks very nice and i am going to really really wear it a lot of time this is something which i feel is again a steal and you know it is so good when you just exactly get what you have been looking for or what you have been thinking for such a long time i I'm a, I'm a sucker for combat prints. I, you know, last winters I got a combat print jacket. Before that I got a combat print pajama. And um, I have been, uh, you know, really obsessing over the military, the army green color of late. So this is what I got. A combat print t-shirt or a top. It's not exactly a t-shirt. I would say it's a combination of a t-shirt and a top because the fabric is of a t-shirt fabric and it, it has mega sleeves which is just attached to the it just flows with the neck and it has an elasticated waist which gives it a very nice fitting and otherwise it's loose it's casual it's a sort of laid back uh you know it gives you a laid back look but i find it so stunning so i think i got this one for 200 rupees and this top which I just showed you, I got it for 150 rupees. I am still in a state of shock as to how I got how I got such great stuff at such incredible prices. Incredible. Okay, so the next next thing which I got is this really cute t-shirt. I am just going to wear it with my PJs or with my shorts at home at night in summers. It's really cute. And I also got one more t-shirt. Okay which is this one uh, just a simple white t-shirt with these with this cute little print over it and it also has a cute little heart on the nape area and again so cute so pretty i got both these t-shirts from the same guy and i bought it for 100 rupees each yes so next thing i got are these pajamas i love these for their print. I love the elastic print that it has. What I love the most about these pajamas is that it is not a print of black and white. In fact, it's a, it's a very, very, very dull beige color and that is what it, uh, you know, they have combined it with black. And this is what I really liked about it. It's a very beautiful color combination. I love the print. The fabric is so soft. The elastic is so comfortable. And I like to wear comfortable and a little loose things and it's just a full length pajama and I'm really gonna <laughs> rock it, I'm sure. So this is next thing which I got and I think I got it for 100 rupees. And last but not the least is this super pretty, super stylish skirt. Look at this guys, look at the print 
look at the flare that the skirt got it has a linen underneath so it's not even gonna <coughs> see through it has an elasticated waist from behind okay guys uh, in today's video there is something very special for you all and it's very very special to me I am going to introduce somebody extremely special to me now this person takes interest in practically whatever I do be it my YouTube videos be it my makeup be it my you know anything under the sun this person takes interest in everything involves in everything I do helps me in everything so you won't believe that the video that I'm recording right now this person is standing behind the camera checking everything out uh, set the camera for me, set the tripod, the lighting and everything and help me out to understand you know the background and the best place where I can sit and shoot this video so let me finally introduce you to this very very special person I can't um, uh, help you know smiling rather getting a big smile on my face because this is I mean you just have to meet this person please so this is whom I'm talking about, my little son Arav. Say hi to everybody. Hello. So Arav has been such a sweetheart. He helps his mama in everything. I think it's such a blessing, touch wood by the grace of God, if you get to have a kid like him who takes so much of interest in your interests. You know, which is I think very, um, it's actually you know parents do it for their children and in my case I'm so blessed touch wood that my child has always taken so much of interest in whatever mama does I think he's very happy with the fact that mama is home mama gives him time I quit my job just to spend more time with him but I'm so happy with my decision that being home I can still do whatever I want to do and I, I can involve my child in all my uh, jobs and tasks and he's learning so much and I learn so much from him trust me you guys he is the guy who tell, told me who taught me how to set a tripod and he tells me so many things related to my camera and he he actually he's learning how to edit videos and he tells me mama if you are busy uh, just teach me how to edit your videos I will do it for you and I can even upload your videos on your YouTube channel so this is something which I think is incredible so thank you so much Arav without your help this was not possible <laughs> say something if you want to say something do you want to say something? Okay. are you happy doing the YouTube channel uh, video things with mama? oh great so thank you so much so this is what I wanted to uh, he is whom I wanted to introduce you guys to my most special person in my life my son my life my sweetie little boy so on this note once again let's meet next time and till then stay safe stay happy bye bye